Minago yabe namakota jemacha nakoniya techina. I'm going to watch the image of Gobi. Okay, I'm going to watch the image of Gobi. I'm going to watch the Hawi Waji. Hawi Waji. Now there's two ways to say the month. This means the month of the year. Hawi Waji. It means month. There's two ways to say. There's two ways to spell. We can say our this month is September, and we call this the the yellow, the turning of the leaves. The leaves turn yellow month, or the the turning of the color of the leaves. And it's spelled, or it's said. Oh, I'm gonna have to get a different marker. My marker must be dry. Okay. Now there's two ways to say this. Wachpe riri hawi. Wachpe riri hawi. Or Wachpe ri we. And it's all turning of the leaves moon. The leaves turn yellow moon. That's what it's that's what it is. And that's this month is September. This is September. This is the month September. Now, today is Monday. Amba, 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 Waka, Gichuni. And what this means is, it's the day after the holy day. It's the day after Sunday. That's what this translates to. Amba, Amba, Waka, Gichuni. This is Monday. And it is September, Monday, September. It's the seventh today, so it is the Amba, oh sorry, Amba Iyushna. It's the seventh day of the month. So I just wanted to share that with you. Today, Amba Nen, uh, we're gonna do some. We're gonna go over the seasons. We're just gonna go over some basic vocabulary today. I know that we've gone over some of these, but it's good to be repetitive. I'm going to go over the seasons with you today, as as well as colors. Maybe we will do the seasons first. The seasons, you know, as you know, right now it's it's khtedo, khtedo, and it's fall, and it's spelt like this. Khte. Make sure I spell it. I guess it doesn't really matter how I spell it. Do. Khtedo. I know that's hard. Khtedo. And that is the fall, and that's right now, the yellow leaf month. The leaves are turning yellow. Fall. The fall, fall weather is here. We have winter, which is coming now, which is coming right after. And we, 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 no, we, Nadu, sorry. I practiced this morning, I knew I was going to mess up that. Wani yedu, wani yedu, wani yedu. See it? Wani yedu, wani yedu. And that is winter. Spring, wani wedu, wedu ha. Spring is here.
Chuck? Oh, yeah, of course. Uh, summer? Let me think here now. Oh, sorry. Yeah, summer. Uh, Weedoha. 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 Summer. Weedoha. Summer. Weedoha. Sorry, this I thought this was hard. There are other words that go with the the um, the seasons. Um, here are some of them. Like, um, let me let me think of a word here. Choza. Um, we, 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 Wani Edo Sten, uh, Chok, um, I'm sorry, just wait. I had it, I, I was saying all this in the, in the thing back there. Um, we Edo Ha, we Sten, um, Chuik Nagaje, uh, Nina Chozahe. In the winter time, do you wear a very warm coat? Choza means to be warm. Um, now, when it's the mid middle of winter here, and you're sitting on the couch, and it's 40 below outside, and you're freezing, and you are chuida, chuida ha. And you'll grab a blanket. Net, 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 chuida ha. Are you cold? Chuida. That means cold. Chuida. Chuida. Cold. Now, when you put your um, ice, or when you go skating on the on the ponds in the winter time, the ponds are dasaga. They are frozen. The saga, that's to be frozen. And then the ice itself, ochaha. It's called ochaha. That's the ice. That's the ice, maybe that's formed on your windshield or the ice on the snow, the ice that you skate on, the ice that children, the children, um, Play on, ochaha. Oh yeah, this is a, a G. And like I said again, I don't care if you you spell them any way you want to spell them. I'm not your spelling teacher. You spell them the way that you can say them. You can spell them any way, like I said, that you want. Now this one here, as you notice, the last couple of days, tade amba. You know, it was very windy. Tade amba. Um, there's also another word that we use for windy, and I will show it. Show you that right away here. Tade Amba. And that's windy. Um, this word was, I've just le recently learned this word. When I was growing up, my mom and dad never said, or I don't remember if they use that word very often. We used, we use that. And that is also windy. Ganuza. Nina ha, amba na nina ganuza. This bay is very windy. Ganuza. In a winter time, the uh, uh, amba nen gan uh, amba nen nina uh, chuid uh, nina. Yeah, no. Okay, never mind. That that's not gonna work. My my brain is not working. Um, another thing in the winter time, when the oh my goodness, in the winter time now, especially on Christmas Eve, wahi ha, wahi ha. I love it when this happens when on Christmas Eve, it is snowing. Wahi ha. Yeah. What else? Oh, I guess I could, I, I'll do it. I don't have it on here, but I will do magaju. 
and that is raining as it is today. Ambanen Magaju, it is raining today. Um, I, gave, I did you the times of week, the times of the day, you know, I did Hayakej, Hayakena, Weiduha, uh, Weiduha Sam, um, Hayak, uh, no, not Hayaken, um, Hahebi. And then I told you I had another word for you for the midnight. For uh, midnight, it's um, Ho Chang Go Ho Okay, wait, just wait, I'll write it down. Ho Changa. Ho Changu. I said, I can't say it today, why I said this last. Oh, well, that's easy. Ho Chagandu. Ho Chagandu. And I don't know why, because Ho Chagandu means way down at the very middle here, is what I, I, I translate it to, to be. So that's probably why it's called midnight. Because it's, I don't know, way down, right down so below. Us. Down. Yeah, the sun is like way down. Yeah, exactly. I have some other words, but those are, oh, I guess I also have um, these here. We can do the blizzard and the blizzard uh, is ijamna tang. That's a blizzard, ijamna tang. <laughs> ijamna tang. Ijamna means to blow and tang means like it's a big blow, it's a bigger blow, and that is a blizzard. And then we have ijamna, and that is just when the wind is blowing, you know, the ground drifts, and uh, if the wind is high and the snow is just blowing across, you can see the wind, that's, that's just ijamna. It's not a storm, it's the wind is blowing, ijamna. And that is just blowing snow. Ijamna, Ijamna Tang, a blizzard. Ijamna is just blowing snow. Oh, and this year I said, what did I say? I knew this was wrong. No, that's okay. It's not actually wrong. It's just said differently. Because um, Wa is also summer. I was going to say that Wa is also summer. And those are pretty much all um, that the words on my on my thing for seasons. Uh, the next thing we're gonna we're gonna do. I'm gonna I'm gonna explain the colors to you. Um, that's one of the things that um, they tell us not to teach when you teach language. But everybody wants to know the colors. We're, we teach you common phrases and how to trans how to um, conjugate verbs, and then we work into the colors. But I'm going to tell you the colors today. We have ri. And as you can see, this is yellow. Now, we also have ri, which also means orange. Ri, yellow, ri. Orange. Now, this one has pejito. Um, some people say pejinto, but it, you can say it whatever you want, and that is green. Pejinto or pejito? They have pejito here. Be related to yeah, probably. The green medicines. Saba. Saba. Um, when I was growing up, my, 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 my parents never said Saba. They said Sab. But you see, you can still hear the A, Sab. 
See that? Sab. But for the um, beginners, we, we, we just say Saba. And then we have Sha. Sha. And like red, Sha Imna. And that is pink. Sha, Sha, Sha Imna. Sha, Sha Imna. I'm just going to use my black, my black marker. Ska. Winchashta Ska. That white man. No, kidding. <laughs> yeah, Winchashta Ska. Naish. Na. Na to. To. Zitgana uh, to. Washtena. That blue bird is beautiful. Now we have Choda. Choda. The X and the H make the same sound. That's that choda, like you're clearing your throat to spit or something. Like choda, not so harsh though. Like don't go choda. You go choda, and that is gray. Wamni choda wamnaga. I seen a gray eagle. And our last color that I'm going to share with you. Z. Oh, I'm going to put brown, uh, brown with a, oh, I forgot my R, sorry, can't spell brown in English, kidding. <laughs> Z, Z. Uh, Tosha, purple. Ri, Ri. Pejinto, sab, saba, sha, sha, sha imna, ska, to, choda, choda, zi, tosha. Yellow, orange, green, black, red, pink, white, blue, gray, brown, purple. Those are all your colors of the rainbow, people. There's a magaju kumuga for rainbow. Oh, okay. Magaju. Magaju. Kamoga. K-M-U-G-A. Yeah. Kamoga. Kamoga. And that's Kamoga. all your colors right here. That's the colors of the rainbow. And the colors of the rainbow are all these except for maybe white and black. Maguja. Magaju. That means to rain. Kumga, 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 Um, I'm not sure. Kumga means to sit. That's what I get. To, that's what I. The translation I get out of it, and it must be all the colors of the rainbow to sit. That's how. I, that's what I, the translation I get out of it. Okay. Now, so I did the colors, we did the seasons. Now, um, when we, um, when I did the language lesson, I never really, um, really um, said a whole lot about the, I'm going to um, write some words down. We went through some of these words. Some of these words were in your first four lessons that we did, but I, some of them I didn't teach you. So this is another one. Now, how you spell this I, like again, I'm going to tell you how to say it. How you want to say it is up to you, or how you want to spell it. But this is cha. Uh, 
Hochnach ja bi hinkna asambi ish chashmu ya bi achinga ha. Cha! Do you want coffee, milk, and sugar? Cha! Maybe. Maybe I do. Maybe I don't. Cha! Maybe. And um, I'm just going down. The, I'm just going down the um, the list as they're coming, in no particular order. Just a, a word list. So if one doesn't relate to the next word, don't don't be alarmed. They they won't be related to each other. They're just. Um, I'm just going down the list as they're appearing in my book here. So I am going to go. I know we we learned a little. I think I believe I told you. I'm going to put the. Chinja, chinja num, noha. I have. This is to be a chi I child. I have two ch children. Chinja num noha, child. Uh, oh, chinja nina juicy nun. That child is very small. Um, chinja nen induka. This child is hungry. Um, Chinja Jaska. That child is white. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. Eh, eh, eh. It is means it is. You know, um, um my mother would say, um, uh, she was a smoker. She always had she always had a pack of Mark Ten, I believe she smoked. Uh Chani uh Chani Chaniska Jamak oh. I don't know. I don't know where it is. Ja, ja. It's right there. You know, that's what she'd say. Ja, it's right there. Maybe I just didn't want her to smoke why I never seen them, but. Naish adaha. Adaha. Hochnach ya bi wa chinga ha. Do you want coffee? Ha. Adaha mako. Ha. Give me some. This is adaha. It means some. Adaha. Some. Um, what else can I say? Uh Ahua bi skuya ya chinga ha. Huh. Uh mak uo. Do you want some cake? Yes. Uh, give me some cake. Adaha mak uo. Okay. Now we have and I think what I call these I, I believe are articles. That's what I call these when you're um when you're Putting your language structure together, these are add-ins that you you put into your uh, sentence. And I'm going to go ekta, ekta. I don't know. It's all it's all the same. Ekta. Now, ekta, ekta, ekta. This could be at. Right? Ekta. Ekta wa hi. I got there. I got, oh no. Huhujubina ekta nakt. I'm going, no, that didn't sound right. But, but it will sound right with this one. I'm going to Regina. Huhujubina ekta nakt. I'm going to Regina. This, you can use this in three. Uh, or at. Two ats and a two. Akta, akta, akta. O wakmaja waksuyesh tida akta. Tida akta waksuya. I forgot my pen at home. Akta. I forgot my pen at home. N. Now, this one's easy. This means also at. Chahat ing en wati. I live at Carry the Kettle. Um, um, I'm trying to think of other, I guess, 
a living at Carry the Kettle is uh, is a good one. And what tea. We did some of these. These were on your word list earlier. And this is another one. I, I said I like this because this was a good word to um, distinguish the two G's. And if you remember, gara. If you can remember, gara is to make. Ahuabi. Khtaniha ahuabi odam wa gara. Yesterday, I made lots of bannock. Khtaniha, yesterday evening, ahuabi bannock oda wa gara. I made lots of bannock yesterday. Just, just so you know how to use them in the, the, the sentences. Um, yeah, you go make coffee. I, um, I remember my mom, my mom, you know, you, when we were growing up, you would hear um, the older ladies talking. And um, it was always about, you know, these young people, uh, you know, they're all, they see a, a young, young, young man and a young woman walking around together and, you know, they're going around together now, they're together, they're with each other. And that's what it means with, to be with someone or to be with something. Uh, oh no. Chashmuyabi ish asambi suda hochnachya uh, gichi hochnachya bi watching. Ka milk and sugar with coffee I'll have. Oh, and I've I've shared I know you guys this one here. Uh Chinjabi, Gua, Nechi Gua, Nechi Uo, Gua, Gua. Gua means to come. Come here. Gua. Gua, come here. Mi chungshi. Gua, my daughter, come here. Gua, come here. Gua, gua. And, you know, ha. Ha. Uh, Amba nen magaju ha. Ha. Is it raining today? Yes, it is. Uh, amba nen ganuza ha. Is it a windy day? Today amba. Is it a today amba ha? Ha, you tell me. Is it a windy day today? Yes, it is. Is it raining today? Ha, huh, yes, it is. Would you like a haknachya biya chinga? Ha. Huh. That's yes, yes. And I'm going to tell you no right away so that you know what yes and no is. Hiya. And that means no. Haknachya biya ching. Hiya. Do you want coffee? No, I want tea. Ahuabi hinkna asambi sudaya ching. Here, asambi suda o chingesh. Do you want some bannock and cheese? No, I don't want any cheese. That's just like, you know, words that you can use. I'm just giving you um, examples of how to use the words in the sentences. Oh, and I told you about, uh, I, you know, that this. Hahebi, hahebi, which is when the, su when the sun has gone down. So that is nighttime, hahebi. Just give me half a cup. Means half. Um, I went through, I told you, um, the month of September. Um, it's just the way the older people said things because we didn't have um, the Jillian can calendar back in the day. So instead of um, saying, I'm, oh, I'm 14 years old or I am, I am, um, they use the moon as their time. 
because they use the stars for everything. That's where our, all our, our lessons and our, for any kind of um, sun dances and stuff, it's all related to the stars. And there's a um, book on star knowledge as well that I, I have um, a copy of, if anybody would like. Do you have a book of the star knowledge? I think I have one copy. I had like eight copies and I gave them away. But I, I, I do, I kept one copy for myself. I do have it. Huh, Hayakaj, 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 Huabi, Skuya, Oda, Wing, Ah, Wagahakt, Ah, Mitagusha, Ihakik, the Chen. Tomorrow I'm going to make a cake because it's going to be my granddaughter's birthday. Hayakaj tomorrow. Hayakaj ishten otua nakt. Tomorrow I'm going to go to town. Hayakaj ishten huhujubina nakta ishten amogia amogia baksa jechen. No, I can't. I, I don't know the word to fix it. I was saying tomorrow I'm going to take my car to Regina because it's broken, but I couldn't. I, I couldn't remember how to say fix it. Hayakaj <laughs> tomorrow. That is tomorrow. How do you spell tomorrow? With two M's? No. Oh, two R's? Yeah. Okay. Forgetting my English now. You just can't write in English. Yeah. <laughs> Hayakana. Hayakana. This is tomorrow. Hayakana is morning. Hayakana. You know, in the morning time I always say, Hayakana wash day. Good morning. Hayakana. Hayakana. And that's morning. Hayakena. Hiha. Hiha. It's kind of like a. Hteru. This is last night. Hiha. Last night. Hiha. Hinapa. You know, um, we hinapa. When the sun's coming up, hinapa means to appear, hinapa. And I, I believe that's why they call, um, they say, um, we hinapa, when the sun is rising, the sun is rising. This means to appear. Appear. You know, um, uh, <laughs> okay, I was gonna say I was gonna make a sentence about appear here. Chinja ja hinapa, that child appeared. Are you kidding? Yeah, I was gonna say that, but okay, I better not. I thought. Shaggy chi umba umba ten umbi umba chen chinja. Hinapa, yeah, those two went around together and just and Chinja Hinapa, yeah, and then all of a sudden this child, <laughs> then all of a sudden this child appeared, yeah. Hinapa, Oda Chinja bi yo na. Okay, <laughs> you guys, you guys don't help. You guys got to keep me focused here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here's I like this word here. Yeah. <laughs> Hinkna. Hinkna. And and um I always use coffee. Let's see. Let me think of something. Um Ahuabi Hinkna Tanomak U. Give me some bannock and meat. Or some bread and meat. Hinkna. Uh I said I use coffee all the time. What can I do? Um, what can I use? Uh, okwa. No, I won't use that because I'm going to struggle with that one. Hinkna. With, uh, oh, I know what I can use. You've, you, um, we went through husband and wife. Jehikna to. That, 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 they're together and hikna to. Um, how do I, how do I translate that? 
Hiknatu. They're there and they're together, I suppose. I no, that's not a good example. We'll move on, because I'm just confusing myself more. Hikna, Hinkna, Hinkna, and and I told you no. Now I, we did, um, I have the cup, the bowl, and the fork. We did that, but I will do it again for you. That is your cup. That's your fork. Kishkan. Oh, I will do, we'll do a... Yogapte, that's your plate. Yogapte shkob, and that's your bowl. What else do I not have here? Uh, Mina, that's your knife. And uh, what do I not have up here? Kishkan, huh? Yeah, Kishkan. It's Kishkan, and that's your spoon. Cup, fork, plate, bowl, knife, spoon. Now, again, we're just going on, we're just moving on. These are just in my, I'm gonna move on to another word. Okna, okna. Um, how would I use that in a sentence, okna? Iinjona ne hokna kyabi hokna. This cup has coffee in it. Okna. I in juna ne. I in juna ne. bi okna. Adaha. No, not adaha. Um, Hochnachia bi okna. This cup has coffee inside it, in it. Okna. And that okna means within it. Within it. Ah. Uh, ne. Chinja. Chinja. That's not the right way to say it, but I'm going to say it. It means when you're pregnant, it means um, that, that, that's not how you say you're pregnant, but I was trying to tell you that I have a baby within my belly. Nehe okna. Chinja. I have a belly. I have a baby within my belly. I'm telling you, I don't. But I'm. I'm telling you that. <laughs> a food baby. <laughs> oh, um, this one is a good one. Owanga, Owanga. Uh, remember, we had some some um, back in the day. All you know, all the um, the older people. You know, this Nakoda was spoken by everyone when I was a child. And I remember on Halloween night, we'd go, we'd go to Halloween and uh, this, uh, this one, he passed on since then, this one gentleman that we go, he'd, oh, he'd do everything to us. He'd make us sing and then he'd give us potatoes for our candy or he'd sing and he'd give us like um, pieces of wood or charcoal. Like He just gave us like weird things. And he used to call one of his nephews Owanga Nej. Owanga? Owanga is a bed. And he used to call this, this young boy Owanga Nej. Apparently, this young boy used to pee his bed all the time. So he used to call him Owanga Nej. Now, I guess Owanga Nej means to pee your bed. Owanga. That's a bed. Yeah. Owanga Nej. I don't know. I don't know why I, I thought of that. That's when I see Owanga. That's the first thing I thought of that. These older gentlemen used to call him that Owanga Nej. He must have peed the bed all the time. <laughs> no, <laughs> but that was his, that, that's what they called him. Mm 
I, 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 I'll probably never do this again. Tuinjuta. Tuinjuta. That means to wed someone. Wed. Wed. Huh? Tuinjuta. They're, they, they're going together, so now they're going to get married. Um, like I said, these are just random words. We did um, store um, ihaki. I, I mentioned that ear, earlier. Mitaguja wakbiri amba wikjamnaja. Ihakikt uh, on the tenth on the tenth day of September, my granddaughter will have her birthday. Ihaki. This is a birthday. This is for your birthday. Amba Amba Daya. Amba Ihak Ihaki Daya Yuha. Have a good birthday. Uh Yabi Oma Patu Niaga Jujuo. will you buy me coffee? But you pay. Ga ga ju Gajuju. Hochnach Yabi uh Hoch Hochnach Yabi Oma Patu. Buy me coffee. Chen Nia Gajujuo. But you pay for it. Gajuju to pay. How's that for a sentence, I think? Gajuju. And you can spell this anyway, and that's to pay. Ga, ju, ju. That's how it's, that's, and that's to pay. Now, when you're laying in your bed, you always need a imbahi. And that is a pillow, imbahi. I spell it right, Imbahi. Mm, imbani, sorry. Imbani. Imbani. And that is your pillow that you sleep on. Imbani. Oanga tang imbahi numbam noha. On my bed, I have two pillows. Oanga je imbahi numbam noha. On my bed, I have two pillows. Jechedu, always, it's always like that. My, my, uh, my father used to say that, huh? Jechedu, it's always like that. This is always, always. Jechudesh, jechudesh, it shouldn't be like that. If you don't want it to be like that, you add your SI to make it a negative. Jechesh, jechesh. Mm. I didn't do, I, I was, I'm not going to do the round. I'll do that when I do the, because there's also other, um, like the square, the rectangle, the flat line. I will do those another time. I won't, so I'm not going to do the round. Um, oh, another, another one I never, this is a good one. Um, this is the sign, I know this one. Sija, Sija. That is bad. Nina Sija. Okay, before we wrap up today, we're going to go, I know we went over this, but for one last, I'm going to, this here you can, um, I can do it several ways. I can tell you the women's way and the men's way, and you know, I think that's what I will do. Um, let's do brother first. Because there's two men and women say these things different here. Now, my brother, if I'm going to say my brother, my, oh, this is my, this is my older brother. He is me, my, Tim known, me Tim no, 
Litimno. And that's what I would say. He is my older brother, and this is the female. This is the female speaker, and that's my older brother. Now, if my brother was to say my older brother, he would say mechinga, mechinga. I'm so um, I'm sorry. Yep. Mechinga. That's what a man would say, how he would say my older brother. Meching Mechinga. And that's older brother. But see, I would say Metimnon and he would say Mechinga. Now if I was gonna say my younger brother, I would say Misunga. Misunga. Because I'm a woman. So the females would say Misunga. And that's your younger brother. Now, if my brother was going to talk about his younger brother, he would say Misung. Misung. My, my younger brother, Misung. Misung. I would say. It's pretty much the same, huh? Oh no, I knew it wasn't right because they don't sound the same. Okay, my older brother's be team known. My older brother for the man would be. And my, uh, my, this is my sunga. This is what the, uh, the men would say for my younger brother. And the women would say, yeah, it's the same. Mm -hmm. It is. Yeah, because they always say the third, yeah, they are the same. I was taught now, if I'm going to, this is my younger brother, my older brother. Male and female. Now I'm going to tell you to say um, your older brother. Your older brother for the female for the female who's, who speaks. My older brother would be Nitimnon. Nitimnon. This is your older brother. This is Ni. That's you. Me. This is my older brother. Now I'm giving that brother to you. This is your older brother. Ni. Timnon. And that's your, and that's the uh, female. I'm a female saying, and that's my um, my. And um, again, it says my older brother. It's not. It's your younger brother. Uh, how do I spell young? I don't even have it young spelled. Oh yeah. And that's how my younger brother would be. Now the males for the younger brother, for your younger brother, that's your Nisunga. Nisunga. And this is the male. That's what my mom, my brother would say about his younger brother. Nis um, that's your younger brother. Jenisunga. Jenisunga. That's your younger brother. That's your younger brother. Would, would Nitimno be your older brother? Oh, <laughs> yeah, it is, sorry. Yeah, these are all older. It does say that right here, too. I'm getting myself mixed up because I don't have them. So Nisunga would be... Your older brother. Your older mm -hmm. or young, your younger brother? Nitimno's older, Nisunga's yeah, oh, younger. Nitimno, that's my older. Nitim known. That's your older brother. It's not my older brother. That's your older brother. Nitim known is my brother. Nitim known is your brother. That's your older brother. Nisunga. That's your younger, uh, your older brother. That's yeah. I'm giving them to you. It's not mine anymore. That's yours. That knee is making it yours. We're gonna go through a, a, a few phrases before. Uh, maybe about 15 of them. They're just like, um, just to help you ask questions, I guess. These are like some questions and just 
little phrases that, that would be helpful for you to learn. Now, you see the question mark, but it also starts with a D. When you, when you start a sentence with a D, you do not have to use the question mark if you don't want to, or you could put he at the end. Token yashka. And that means, um, how are you moving? Token yashka, or you can put token yashka he. You can put this, and that is a question, but because it starts with a D, it doesn't need the question mark. Token yashka. How are you moving? I'm not moving very well. Um, my leg is aching. I'm not doing well. I'm not moving well. Donach ihaki. Donach ihaki. Donach ihaki. Donach ihaki. Donash ihaki. How old are you? Donash ihaki. Ah, I won't say how old I am. Never mind. Wana omakna wikjemna numba sam napjua. I am 29 years old. Wana, right now. Wana omakna, the year. Wikjemna, she is. Week Jemna Sam Nepju Nepjunga. Now, years ten past nine. She is twenty nine years old, is what it, what it translates to. And like I told you at the beginning, how our Nakoda sentence structure is um, develop, uh, is set up. That's why your nouns are in the front. Wana okma winjak wikjemna sam nupja. I am twenty nine years old. Tiokada, tiokada. Is it hot in this house? Tio, house. Tio, tio. Kada. Inside, T-O, Kada. Is it hot inside? That's what this is. House, inside, O Kada. Is it hot inside? T-O, T-O Kada ha. T-O Kada ha, you're asking a question. Making it as, adding the ha, making, giving it your question marker. T-O Kada ha. Nichi. Nichi, uh, sorry. Nichi, Nichi, just wait, give me a second. Okay, Nichi, Nichuida, Nichuida, sorry. Nichuida, Nichuida, sorry, Hata. Nichuida, I'm asking you, I'm asking you a question again. Nichi, Nichuida, Nichuida. Are you cold? This is another question. It's just nichuid. Are you cold? Nuchuida he. Are you cold? I'm, I'm putting the he at the end and making it, putting it a quest, the question marker at the end. Nichuida he. Nichuida meaning you. Are you cold? Nichuida. Chuida is to be cold. And this is making it you. I'm asking you. Are you cold? Ha, huh, machuida. Now I'm saying I'm cold because I'm saying ma, machuida. Ha, huh. nina machuida. Yes, I am very cold. I am cold. Um, I'm trying to, as I'm doing this, Uh, let's see, how can I use this here? There's lots of things I can use, but... Um, Ambanen, uh, no. 
that's not a good one. Um, Nakonia uh, Daya Nakonia Beja Daya Niabi. That's there we go. Nakonia Daya Niabi. Do you speak Nakota good here or does Nakwaish? I don't know. I do not know. I don't know. That's what this is. I don't know. You know, somebody. Ina Dokia. Snakwaish. Uh, Mazaska Oda no Haha. Do you have lots of money? Snakwaish. I don't know. Washmo. Washmo. Washmoha. 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 And that means to, to have lots of snow. The snow is deep. Washmoha. Washmoha. That is deep snow. Washmoha. Tiosni. Tiokada. Tiosni. Tiosni. Osni. Remember Osni? That's cold. And T. Is it cold inside? Tiokada, is it hot inside? Tiosni, is it cold inside? Um, macho, machoza, machoza. Here, Tiosni, here. Here, machoza. I am warm. I am warm. Nichoza, here. Are you warm? Me chosa me chosa nia nia chosa ha. Are you warm? Me, I am warm. You, are you warm? Ma chosa, I am warm. Ni chosa ha. Are you warm? Iunga. Uh, Iunga at night time. Iunga. And that is to lie down. To lie down. Iunga. Iunga. Tida. And if you look back at Tiosni and Tiokada, Tiosni, Tida. This is your home. Tida, your home. And here is another one. Here's some good ones here. Donach Ihaki. Donach Ihaki. How old is he or she? I was talking about my granddaughter's birthday. Donach Ihaki. Donach Ihaki. How old are you? Oops, sorry. Donach Ihaki. And that's how old are you? Donach Ihaki. Wana. Oh, I guess this. How old is he or she? How old is he or she? How old is he or she? And now I'm going to say. Donach Ihaki. How old are you? And now I'm going to say, oh, how old is she? Now, wana donach ihaki. How old are you? Wana, and I'm just going to add wana on top here. At this time, how old are you? That's what I'm asking. Wana, at this time. Khtaniha oda washpa jachanina impi. Yesterday I cooked lots, so I was very full. I was very full because I cooked very much. I, uh, uh, oda, oda uh, oda Uh, Nina Nimat 
I just had it in my head. Just wait, let me look at it. No dimat a. No dimat a. I am very, very hungry. No dimat a. I was very hungry yesterday, Chen. Ja Chen, oda a. I was very hungry yesterday, so I made lots of soup. No dimat a, no dimat a. I was, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. This is me. I'm no dimat a. I'm hungry. Amba niaza, amba niaza. I used to say that. Amba niaza. That's all day. All day, sit kana to onoa. All day long, the bluebird sang. All day. This is all day. Hi. And then we're gonna go all night now. We went all day, so now we're gonna go all night. Huh? Iaza. Ha, Iaza. Ishtimation ko. You didn't sleep all night? Ha, Iaz. That's all night. I remember my mom used to tell us that if we go out and not come home early in the morning. Ha, 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 Iaz. Tagana, Tagani, Tagan. I forget how she said it, but she meant that we were, all, we were out all night being foolish. Jedwe. When I bought my boyfriend home, my mom said that. Jedwe. I was kidding. That, who's that? Jedwe. Yeah. <laughs> Who is that? Jedwehe. Who is that? Jedwe. I'm putting the he on the end, making it a marker. Who is that? Jedwe. You don't need the marker, but Jedwehe. And then um another another these are just like random words. Nen iodung that I'm telling you, none. Nen iodung. Come and sit here. Nen iodung. Then you can say, you can tell me no. Here. Jachi iodung. No, I'm not going to sit there. I'm going to go sit over here. Oh, sit. Sit here. I'm spelling my, I'm thinking about my words. Sit here. Nen iodung. Nina penamaya. Nina penamaya. I'm very thankful. Nina Pinamaya. Nina means very. And Pinamaya is thankful. And this is to be thankful. Pinamaya. You ever hear somebody gives you something? Pinamaya. But to, if you add Nina in front of it, you are very thankful. Nina Pinamaya. Huh? With Pinamaya. Do, do males say Pinamayaya now? Yeah. Pinamayaya. Yeah. I would say Pinamayaya, and a male would say Pinamayaya. Pinamayaya. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. See, uh, I know a lot of the men, they put that no at the end of it. Like, um, I know, because I heard my dad talk often, I do that all the time, and I know that's not the right way, but that's just habit for me, because I heard my dad talk. Uh. Let's see, what would be a good example? Uh, you don't know nothing, they used to tell me. <laughs> and that's, that's why then my dad would always say the no at the end. But I, when I was younger, like I didn't, it wasn't until recently that, yeah, there's a difference between the male and the female. So to thank everybody, uh, I don't know. Iyuhana uh, Penamaya. I thank you all. I, I would say it like that. There are like, if I was a more fluent speaker, there's probably like, Tuffy would probably not say it like that. Mike would not say it like that because me, I'm a second language learner. I would say, oh, you know, Nina Penamaya. Iyuhana Nina Pia. Panamaya, like you all, I thank you all. Uh, I don't know. I always when I, when when I think of these stuff, like I don't know, yeah, my mom and my, my yeah. No, yeah. And I did ne ne do well. Who are you? 
And then Jechi Io, Jen Iodang, sit there, sit down there, Jen Iodang. That's not, I'm not asking you, I'm telling you. You sit there, Jen Iodang, that's a command. My husband, come here, you sit there. Ina Tagawo, you shut your mouth. I was kidding. <laughs> Thank you all. Nina Sijawi Chashra. Pinamaya, Akawanawi Chimnagint. Me no go ya be na ma ko ta je ma cha na ko ni ya te khina.